What's going on Refractors? I'm back. It's been a little over a year since my last food review and uh, I'll be honest, I didn't plan on making any more videos. Uh, YouTube is too oversaturated and there's no point, you're never gonna make it. But then I saw something today when I went to order food and that is the Rick and Morty meal from Wendy's and I knew if I didn't come out of retirement and make a re review video, who else would give you the right answers on whether this is good or not? Because no other food reviewer does it like me, not a single one. Uh, so here we go, it's right here. I got the um, not bird person combo, which is a chicken sandwich, a spicy chicken sandwich with pepper jack cheese, bacon, uh, dill pickles, and habanero hot honey sauce, whatever, whatever that entails. So uh, let's get right into it. Uh, I was expecting a, a little better packaging. I don't know if that's just my location or if they didn't really put any effort in at all, but here it is. It uh, doesn't look that appetizing, I'm gonna be honest. It kind of looks like the nasty patty from SpongeBob but let's go ahead and get into it. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Y'all are not gonna believe this, but it kind of tastes like a spicy breaded chicken sandwich with habanero sauce, bacon, and dill pickles on it with pepper jack cheese. Yeah, um, it doesn't really taste any different than anything else you get at Wendy's. It is good though, I mean, I'll give them that. It just, it doesn't taste bad. You know what it is? I haven't seen the past two Rick and Morty seasons, so I don't think I'm really smart enough to really be able to give you the right answer here, but I will say it's good. Anyways, guys, I'm not gonna waste your time eating this for 14 minutes, just chewing. Uh, it's a chicken sandwich with some spice on it. It's good. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a year when something else interests me.